welcome back to my channel, Megan Victoria. So today we're gonna be doing a good old fashioned haul. So I was at Gen Beauty LA this past weekend. As you know, a lot of you guys already know my Instagram is full of the good stuff. So if you do wanna follow me on Instagram, it is just Megan Victoria X. But anyway, we as beauty influencers are so lucky and fortunate to receive all this like good, amazing product. Now, we get a lot of it. Like, and I mean, I mean a lot of it, and it honestly can get pretty overwhelming, and you're kind of like, oh my god, there's so many things. So you naturally have an instinct to be like, oh, I really want to try that. Oh, that looks interesting. This looks cool. So instead of showing you like everything we got that, you know, it could be like some of interest, some not, I just decided I would like pull things that I was really excited about that I wanted to try, that I wanted to experience, that I wanted to share with you guys, and then I thought it would be more of a collective, like... A little bit more intimate haul. So these are all the exciting things that I'm ready to show with you guys. So we've got hair care, we have skincare, we have makeup, we have still a lot of things to show. So with all that said, we're gonna stop rambling, we're gonna get into the video, and these are all my Gen Beauty goodies. They're also on my face. The next video will be a first impressions of all the makeup. But without further ado, here is just like a lot of shit that I like. So enjoy. So the first thing, this is just fun. Look at this hair dryer. This is like the cutest little hair dryer. Dry, driver, it's a hair driver. It drives your hair apparently. So this is from Eva NYC. Um, and I love their brand in general. They make the most beautiful, amazing hair mist. I actually think I have it in here. So might as well take it out now. Here it is. The uh, Main Magic 10 in 1 Priming uh, Primer. So it's like does all those good hair benefits for you to be real talk though i have this and i don't know how like phenomenal of a product it is it could be amazing it could not be but it smells so good that i will put this in my hair till the day i die like it just smells so freaking good so i had to include it but the fact we got a little hair dryer and it's like pastel pink i was like this is so springtastically adorably amazing so that is so so cute it also came in this bag this is the coolest, most holographic, magical bag ever. So let's start with the goodies inside here. So I kind of like, I organized things a little bit. Yes, I know, me organizing, but I did, so respect. So in here, this is more makeup fun little things. So we'll start off first. We got the Mykonos Lashes by Lily Lashes. Why aren't they in the thing, you may ask? Well, they're on my face. I also did a first impressions of all this stuff, so that is this whole look and Guys, like, my makeup looks good. Like, we all know this, right? Yeah. So, um, <laughs> all these products are already in action on my face, so that's really exciting. So, I am wearing the Lily Lashes in Mykonos. Then we have the Buxom palette, which is also the eyeshadow palette I'm wearing. This palette is actually beautiful. So, this is called Dolly's Wild Side Eyeshadow Palette. It's all these, like, mauve kind of purple tones, a little bit of, like, those dusty rose. We got some champagnes. We got a lot of shimmers and mattes. So it actually has a very good wide variety of shades in here, especially if you're into more purpley eyeshadows, that palette's great. And it blended like phenomenally on my eyes. I'm like, oh wow, like it's pigmented, it blends. I'm really impressed, it looks great. Um, I was really excited that Lancome was actually at Gem Beauty. I was not expecting them there, so they were there. And I got some highlighters from them. So this is the dual finish highlighter in luminous gold. Guys, it is gold, like it goes on your face, like. I don't know if you can see that, but like it goes on like, there we go. Like you can see that it goes on gold. There's no messing around with this highlighter. It's so beautiful. Um, I'm very excited about this. Speaking of highlighters, we have Physicians Formula. So this is a butter highlighter and this one is in pearl and it has like, again, that like iridescence of that purple tone, that kind of like a purple topper. It's like purpley pink, it's really, really pretty. So it kind of goes on pearly, and I actually did top that on the Lancome highlighter because you know, gold highlighters for me are a little like too gold. So I was like, oh, I don't know if I can do full gold, but like I can do that more champagne color. Beautiful. Again, highlighter, this one, oh my God, I'm so excited about this. Okay, so this is the bomb, and I was so excited that the bomb was there, and I was so excited that I got to talk to them and then, you know, do that whole networking thing. Um, but this is the Mary Luminizer. So it's the Mary Luminizer, but it's in like a liquid highlight. This stuff is like just, it's like champagne liquid gold dreams of magic. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. When I put it on today, you'll see this in like the next video or whatever, but you'll just see the me, my face going like, 
Oh my god, like it is just absolutely stunning. We also have another Lancome highlighter, just really quickly. So this one's a little bit, this is called Shimmering Buff. It's a little bit more, actually, you know what, in this lighting, it still has a warm undertone to it. I feel like this one will be better for me. Um, but it definitely has like a nice, yeah, it does. It's like goldeny, but it's not as silvery as I thought. I don't know why I thought that. Maybe it's the weird lighting. But it's definitely more of a lighter gold. I think this one will be great for me. And the other one will be great for like deeper skin tones. And I can definitely like put that in my kit. Then we just have a couple mascaras that I was pretty excited about. So again, there's the Lancome Monster Big Mascara, which I know has had a lot of hype and lots of people talk about. And then two that I know also have had a lot of hype drugstore version are the NYX Worth the Hype. Speaking of hype, um, so this mascara, so I'm super excited to try this one, and then also the Maybelline Total Temptation. I've heard really good things about this one. Also, the packaging is really cute, it's like rose gold, you guys know I like it. So, I was really excited about these guys. Then, what else we got? I think we have some lippy products. Oh, MAC was there, so we got the uh, Velvet Teddy Lipstick and Boldly Bare Lip Liner. I used this today, I've never actually used this shade. The shade's perfect, it's magical. This is such a good lip liner shade, I love this and then of course Velvet Teddy has always been one of my favorites because like we all know the Kylie Jenner lip was a whole thing so it's definitely those two were like fantastic to receive then we've got another liquid lipstick this is what I'm wearing today and I really really like it so this is from IBY Beauty and this is called Vintage um, and then it's a velour liquid lip so it's a nice you know peachy pink liquid lipstick it's really really pretty and then also there is this Loritzy Cosmetics and this is a Montreal girl so I think that's super cool for my Canadian girls and um, this has like this beautiful shift duochrome lip gloss and I'm wearing that right now. So I'm so excited about those ones. What else do we got? We have, oh, there's a brand called Kula and I think they're in Sephora already and I tried some of their stuff out and it was like really fun but they do a lot of like self tanning like skincare kind of benefits. So things like, you know, with SPF, so like a setting spray with SPF. I don't have it here, I don't know where it went. But I'm using it a lot just because it does like the fact it has SPF because I'm not good with uh, sun protection. But this is their Sunless Anti-Aging Face Serum and I keep hearing like amazing things about this so I want to try that for show. Then this guy I swatched. This is the Ultra Repair Tinted Moisturizer from First Aid Beauty. It's like a little like tinted moisturizer but she was talking about like you know it's perfect for say you're leaving the gym you just need a little bit of coverage but also like moisture. I love things that have like double benefits so if, when it can be makeup and skincare I'm like yo super down. So very excited about that. I also when I swatched it it felt just very like like almost moussey like it was very light it was very fluffy and I was like yeah this is a product like I'm down for it. This is good. Then we have the brand Grande Lips, and so they gave me a hydrating lip plumper. So this is really, really pretty, again, peachy pink lip gloss. I'm wearing it as well. Shocking, I know. I tried basically shoving like all these products on my face and like lots of layers of things. So there's a lot of makeup going on. But um, I have this lip gloss on, and then they also gave us our their Grande Primer. And so this is the idea that they, um, it's a lash primer, but it has like lash pumping like peptides and everything. So I'm excited to try that for sure. I know they're very known for their lash serum. So that was another thing, but I've also heard very controversial things whether you should use a lash serum or not. So that's just something to keep in mind. The brand Luxie was there and they make the cutest pink little brushes. And they gave us a set last year, Gen Beauty, um, that was way smaller and these ones are like fluffier sets and I'm like so excited because I love these brushes. They work amazing and like they're just, they usually are a little bit smaller than you know your average say blending brush. Do I have a blending brush in here? Yeah, sort of, not really. Um, but blending brushes tend to be really big and fluffy, and these ones are always like really tiny. So they're so great for like eye work, especially like detailed eye work. And you guys know me, I like to like blend 500 million colors on my eyes. So these are so great for that. So those are all the makeup goodies. What else do we got? Is that everything? I think that's all the makeup goodies. Okay, so now we've got some hair care, skin care. And all that fun stuff. So the first thing we're going to talk about is, oh, this brand. Okay, so I was just introduced to this brand called Numa, And they are a very, like, ingredients-based hair care, like, company. So I'm learning more about them currently right now. Um, but I'm so interested because I'm already reading the ingredients. And I'm like, I'm such an ingredient snob. And actually, the girl, Ashley, who was there, like, representing them and everything, we were kind of, like, geeking out about ingredients. And so I was like, yeah, I can tell when someone's, like, you know, like, trying to tell me a load of crap about a product. Like, I know ingredients and I really love, like, you know, the chemical makeup of makeup and 
hair care and cosmetics and just all of that. So they have really bomb ingredients. I just used their cleanse shampoo. Oh my god, my hair felt so good after using this. I I'm super impressed. And it comes out like really thick. It almost looks like honey. So it's like very strange consistency for shampoo, but it's like amazing, super cool. And so then I'm also super excited to use their strength and um, repair mask. So that's another little thing I'm excited for. And then they also did gave us some dry shampoo. So gotta love dry shampoo. But anytime that I realize like a company has great ingredients, I'm like way more inclined and way more excited to learn and try more of their products. So I'm very excited about that. Oh, same with the Eva NYE. So they also came out with this like blonde leave it in foam. And so it's like purple foam that you put in your hair like after you blow dry it to like tone it. So for all my blonde girls, this may be great. I again, I haven't tried all this stuff. You know, this is just like things I'm excited about. It's more of a haul than like say a first impression, but I'm super excited to try this tone it down blonde leave in foam. Then we also saw Bioderma. They gave us a giant thing of this, so great. So, you know, this is a lovely Missler water. This is the very first Missler water. So this is the OG. Um, they, they get it right, they know what they're doing, but it definitely feels amazing taking off all your makeup. You don't have to cleanse your skin. You don't have to tone. I still do just cause like, I don't like the idea of just wiping my face and being done. Like if that's like, you know, someone using makeup wipes to go to bed, like it's too much for me. So I'm not a huge fan of that. Um, that's fine. And then they also have the IGK Charcoal Detox Dry Shampoo. So I'm excited about that guy. I don't really know what makes that dry shampoo different, but I'm intrigued. Um, and then we also have the Derma E Advanced Peptides and Collagen Serum. I love like pretty much anything by Derma E. I think they're a great company, a great brand. They have amazing products. So this is a little bit anti-aging. I'm like, I'm down for that. I'm starting to feel like going to these events and realizing I'm not the baby anymore. I'm kind of like, I, I'm the young one. What do you mean you're 19? What do you mean you're 20? Like, it's a little weird. I've always been the baby and now I'm not the baby and it's kind of messing with my whole identity. So, talking about being a baby, there's a unicorn mask. So, the brand So AE, which I'm like really good friends with and I think they're all like super sweet people and awesome there. Um, they came out with this like unicorn glow hologram mask. I don't know what the hell it is, but it's unicorn. I want to use it. I want to try it. And then they also have their purifying, brightening, peeling gel. I love this stuff. This stuff is the weirdest thing. You put this on and it's like a chemical exfoliant. It like removes your skin. Your skin is gone and then you have new skin and you're just like, I'm confused. You start like massaging it and literally like you feel the grit of your skin. It's the weirdest thing, but it's so good. So they saw me, they know I love it. So they gave me another bottle of it. And I was like, yay, thank you. Um, we also have Moda brushes. You guys know I love Moda brushes. So I'm always excited to have some new ones. Um, if you guys see products that you've like used or whatever, like I'd love to hear your feedback on them. Um, it's always super helpful to me. So then I learned about this new company called Belief. I'm so into this. So this is their moisturizing eye balm. I'm already in love. Like I'm already in love. I tried so many moisturizers, especially like eye creams and everything. But I never find that like the moisture stays. This I feel like goes right into the skin. It feels so silky and smooth. It's like amazing before makeup. Like when you're putting like, like almost as a primer for your makeup, amazing. And then it really like stays and lasts all day. And you can like touch your under eyes and you're like, yo, they're still there. Like it still feels moisturized and good. And honestly, California is dry AF. So I really was like, like really full on packing on nutrients, moisturizers, serums, all of the things to get myself having a little bit more glow and a little bit more moisture because it's so dry. So then also they have their moisturizing and firming eye cream. I don't know really the difference, but I think this is a more concentrated version. So I'm excited to like try this as well. And that's the same company. Um, then we, oh, I saw Pixie and they um, gave me this like really cute little glow tonic. And you guys know I use the glow tonic pads, but I've never actually tried the like actual product itself. So I thought this was like the cutest little travel thing. I have so many hairs on my nose all the time. Uh, so I thought this was like the cutest little travel -y guy. Then we have Canna Bliss. So this is like a, they, I don't, I, he told me about it and I don't remember exactly what he said, but you know, it's all about like extracting the, um, not THC, but the other part of the plant. I forget, he gave me a whole spiel, but it was also 9 a.m. before the weekend even started. It's been a long weekend. So basically though, this is like using hemp and cannabis like to make products. And this stuff, honestly, like I said, 
California is dry. My nose inside has been totally cracked and I've been like taking a Q-tip and like putting this all up my nose and this is the only thing that's actually made my nose like feel relaxed. But they say it's like a salve. It's called a hemp salve and then it's like for any kind of dry areas and dry patches. So that's super cool. Just three more little products. So then we've got just the Nature Lab Perfect Shine Oil Mist. She uses on my hair and honestly it just made my hair so shiny. I was like, yo, I'm into this. I wanna try that. Um, and it's very light. And all the companies that are at this show, like they really are promoting like good ingredients and, and like, you know, no sulfates and no parabens and da 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 da. So like they're really making health like a prime example of this show. So I thought that was like amazing. And then from First Aid Beauty, again, I love the girl there. She was so fun to talk to. She was really great. Um, this is the Coconut Skin Smoothing Primer. So I actually used this this morning um, underneath my makeup and it made my skin so glowy, but like not greasy. It was like glowy, but then I would like, it was like dry to touch. It was weird, but I really liked it. Um, and then very lastly, Physicians Formula gave us this Rose All Day Oil Free Serum. This stuff is the coolest. So it, number one, smells exactly like roses, but it has that same pink iridescence. I feel like this is like a trend or something, but it's like that really gorgeous duochrome shift. And so you put it on your skin, it gives you this like pinky, glowy, dewy magic. I, I love it. And very lastly, we just have this pure eyeliner. I'm super excited to try this. You guys know I love pure, like, so much. Like, everything. It's just so good. So I'm super excited. I did use this today, actually, and it was very, very, like, smooth and glided on just, like, perfectly. Very pigmented. So purple. So excited about this. I also got to meet Bailey. So Bailey's, like, my contact up here. And, like, she's just great. We just, like, we just hit it off. It was a connection. It was beautiful. Yeah. I love it, she's just fantastic. And what I found also really interesting at the show was they had a lot of like supplements and like vitamins, which has never really been a thing at these shows. So I was like, that's kind of cool. So I'm actually like trying out a bunch of supplements and all that, like, you know, I'm looking into it. It's like weird to just like throw things in your body and be like, yeah, totally. But to research it, I'm like interested, you know? So I do have like a hair gummy supplement and, um, they were talking though exactly like why things work and I love using the science behind things and I love hearing the brand reps really understand their products and know what they're talking about and I really respect that and appreciate that and I think especially in the beauty community it's great to just have like all these products thrown at you but like you really need to understand why you like things and like why you should be drawn to certain things. Like there's, there can be a lot of garbage out in the market and I definitely, I feel that like receiving packages and things. Like I try something, I'm like, this is crap. Like the ingredients are bad, this is bad. But when you find really passionate people who understand their brand and understand their product, I think you can make a really great connection. So that concludes all of the good stuff we got at Gem Beauty. I am so thankful and so appreciative. And like I told you, I just want to show you some of like the favorites, the exciting stuff. I have so much that I've packed away for a giveaway. So don't even worry. There's so many more goodies to share with you guys. But these are just some things that I was like, I want to show you. I want to share. And I'm just excited about. So with that said, the next video that you will see will be this makeup look. And this is using all the new stuff, all the good stuff. And kind of my first impressions, my thoughts on it. Also, my mom's in the video and uh, it gets a little rowdy, it gets a little sassy and it's, 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 it is what it is. So it's gonna be a really great video. I'm super excited for you guys to see it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next video. Have an amazing weekend because I think today this is gonna go up on Black Fr Blue Friday. Black, blue, oh my God, Good Friday. Oh my God, where's my brain? But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Mwah.